All right, hello, Tim Span here um, to answer week one form question. Um, I chose question A about the way that um, products affect me personally as a consumer. Um, I know myself, I tend to attach emotion um, to products I buy as a consumer. Um, so if something frustrates me um, or I think there's a poor quality product, I tend to have a negative emotional reaction towards that product um, that I store even subconsciously without realizing it that keeps me away from that product and vice versa I store good emotional feelings towards products that are good for example um, I know I own a lot of uh, Apple products uh, phone you know iPod computer those things because um, I think that Apple provides good quality products um, so when I think of them I feel positive emotionally um, but simultaneously, I also know that Apple products tend to be more expensive um, sometimes per se than um, competitors. Um, and so I also have that feeling emotionally arise um, where I know, hey, I'm going to be paying quite a bit out of pocket. It's going to be an investment, whatever I um, invest towards my Apple product. Um, so I, personally, I tend to store up emotional feelings either one way or the other towards a company depending on their product and service. Um, another uh, opposite example would be Time Warner Cable. I've had them in the past. Um, I personally had a, a bad customer service experience with them. I could never get through on the phone lines to talk to someone if I had an issue. Um, and so now when I hear the name or see a commercial of Time Warner Cable, I automatically kind of shudder away and have a negative reaction like, oh man, I don't want to deal with that. I don't want to go through that again. Um, and so I'm kind of more resistant to going back down that path in the future. All right, this is Tim. Thanks for listening.